So in my bowl here, I have some um, potatoes that I went ahead and cleaned and washed. So now what I'm going to do first for my potato choco, I'm going to go ahead and start boiling the potato. Then after my potato is nice and tender, I'll come back and show you how to start making the choco. But the first thing I'm going to do right now is to put my potato on to boil. Let's go ahead and put our potato to boil now. So into my pot over here, I will be adding my potatoes and water. So I'll be adding my potatoes there and my water just to cover the potatoes a little. A teaspoon of salt to my potatoes here. Get it started. Toss this up nicely. I'm going to put my stove on and let this boil until my potato is nice and tender. Then I'll come back and show you how to start making the choker. Okay, let's go ahead and check on our potato and see if it's boiled. And I'm going to stick it with a fork, which is perfectly boiled here. So now I will remove the potato from the pot here. I will turn my stove off and I will remove the potatoes. You're going to remove all of your potatoes from the water, okay, and our potato is nicely boiled here, which I have here, nicely boiled. So now we're going to go ahead and get our seasoning to start making our potato choco. Okay guys, so let's go ahead and start preparing the um, potato choco. So I'm going to use my pot to mash my potato because there's a lot of potatoes. So I'm going to put my potatoes back into my pot there and to my potatoes, what I have in my bowl here, my plate, I have some onions that is very, very thinly sliced. I have some chili pepper and some scallion. I am going to be adding this to my pot here and also I added one tablespoon of butter to my pot there so what I'm going to do now I am going to go ahead and start mashing my potatoes and I have I already added my onion to my pot so I am going to be mashing my potato here nicely until it becomes smooth let's mix it all together here sure that all of the ingredients are fully mixed into your potatoes and if you want guys you can go ahead and mash your potato before you add your vegetables it's all up to you with me it doesn't make a difference and look how nicely this is looking already that's what you wanted to see okay so I have one more ingredients to add to my potato to bring it all together and this last ingredient that I'm going to be adding and the way I'm going to be adding it is a secret ingredient and you will not believe how delicious it makes this um, potato choco taste so please guys do not judge this last step until you try it leave me a comment and let me know what you think so my last ingredient over here 
I have some oil that is nicely heating up here and into my dish here I have two flecks of garlic that I went ahead and minced and what I'm going to be doing with this I am going to be adding this to my hot oil and I am going to be chunking my potato so I'm going to wait until my oil is pretty hot in the meantime I will continue to mash my potato here you're going to go ahead and taste for salt and be careful with your salt guys because remember you boil your potato with salt so be careful with salt I'm going to go ahead and give this a nice taste and see if it needed anything else and it does need a little bit of salt so I will be adding a little bit more salt and I will mix this my salt nicely into my potato choker here make sure it's mixed in nicely just like that okay so my last ingredients that I need to add to this is what I'm doing right now with my oil and my garlic so my oil is pretty hot there so what I will do I will go ahead and add my garlic I will turn my stove off because I don't want to burn the garlic I just want the garlic to flavor the oil just like that you're not going to be burning your garlic you just want your garlic to flavor the oil so about a couple of seconds you're going to let that garlic toss up nicely into your oil there just like that and what you're going to do now you're going to take your hot oil with your garlic and you're going to add it all over to your potato just like that and you're going to give this a nice toss and mix that garlic up into your potato mash nicely here just like that make sure it's nicely mixed in show you what it looks like and there you have it guys a nice delicious potato choker there you have it look at that look how delicious that is a nice delicious potato choker and you can have this with roti you can have this with bake you can have this with dollar rice you can have this with anything you like but there you have it a nice delicious potato choker